Good evening. Today I'm going to be transforming y equals f of x, this graph right here, this function right here, uh, into y equals f of negative x plus 1 over 2. So three things are going to happen in this case. First there's going to be a reflection on the y-axis because of the negative inside the f of x function. There will also be an expansion by a factor of 2 horizontally because of this 2 and also a shift to the left by one unit. Excellent. So let's st get started with the point right here, negative 3 and positive 1. I know that I'm drawing it with the red ink, but uh, it's the point on the f of x line. And okay, so first we reflect it on the y-axis then we expand it by a factor of 2, so it goes from 3 to positive 6, then it goes to the left by 1 unit. It lands right there. Okay, then we have 0, 0,3, this point right here. And what will happen with that point is that, actually I'm going to make this appear for now, 0 and 3 is going to become it's going to stay 0 because of the reflection for the reflection since 0 times negative 1 is 0. The expansion also won't do anything to it and then it's going to go to the left by one unit. So it's going to land right there. Hmm. Okay. Um, then we finally have 2 and negative 1 at this point right there and it will get reflected on the y-axis expanded by a factor of 2 and go to the left by one unit. So the final function will look like this. I hope that made sense. And this beautiful graph is y equals f of x, or rather f of negative x plus 1 over 2.